السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته. My brothers and sisters, we are in the month of Ramadan and I want to talk to you guys about the Prophet of Allah, Sayyidina Dawood alayhi salam. Sayyidina Dawood alayhi salam is the father of Sayyidina Sulaiman alayhi salam. Dawood alayhi salam was not just a Prophet of Allah. Remember the story in the Quran in Surah Al Baqarah. Allah mentions to us about how Sayyidina Dawood was pivotal in the battle against Jalut, Goliath, and how Dawood qatala Dawood Jalut, and Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala gives him prophethood, he gives him knowledge. And one of the unique things about Dawood is that he was the king of the people at that time. He was a prophet and he was also endowed, given this amazing ability of being able to manipulate iron as well, subhanAllah. Manipulating iron allowed him to be able to make armor for battles. But Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala also made him someone who was just and upright. They say about Dawood that he had times for the people in the day, he had times for his himself and his family, and he had time for Allah in the day as well. The one third of the night he would stand up praying to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. And the Prophet وسلم, when he mentioned about the superior forms of fasting, he says the most superior fast that someone can fast is Sawmu Dawood, the fasting of Dawood. What was the fasting of Dawood? He would fast every other day in his life. Imagine that. We find it difficult to be able to simply fast a month every year. But Dawood understood that fasting has so many spiritual benefits, brings us close to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. And one last thing I just want to mention about Sayyidina Dawood alayhi salam. Dawood alayhi salam, he was someone who Allah had given a beautiful voice to. And they say when he would recite the, the, the Psalms, when he would recite the, the Zabur, as we call it, his recitation was so beautiful that even the mountains would shake and vibrate and the birds would come to listen to his recitation. We have the Book of Allah, the greatest book anyone has ever been given Allah's words month of Ramadan is a time for us to recite to read and to learn the meanings of this kitab Jazakumullah khair I hope you guys have a wonderful day may Allah accept our fasting and our taraweeh Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullah <laughs> Muhammad